One, two, three, four, media bio. This is the part four of the human brain series. Please make sure that you watched all the previous parts before going ahead with this video. Let's learn about the memory center of the brain. Memory is a complex process that includes three phases, encoding, which is deciding what information is important, storing, and recalling. Different areas of the brain, are involved in different types of memory. The brain has to pay attention and rehearse in order for an event, to move from short-term to long-term memory. And this is called encoding. Well, let's check out short-term memory. It is also called working memory. It is a temporary memory. The prefrontal cortex holds recent events, briefly in short-term memory. It stores information for about one minute, and its capacity is limited to about seven things at once. Wow, this is interesting. For example, it enables you to dial a phone number someone just told you. It also intervenes during reading, to memorize the sentence you have just read, so that the next one makes sense. How cool is that? Hey, that entire area is called the prefrontal cortex. Long-term memory. It is processed in the hippocampus of the temporal lobe. It is activated, when you want to memorize something for a longer time. This memory has unlimited content, and duration capacity, oh my god. It contains personal memories as well as facts and figures. Really interesting right? Now that is the hippocampus of the brain. Our final type of memory in the brain is the skill memory. It is processed in the cerebellum. It relays information to the basal ganglia. It stores automatic learned memories like tying a shoe, playing an instrument, or riding a bicycle. So much knowledge to gain. Well, now we can move to part 5 of the human brain series. Please hit the like button, and also comment down below. And please subscribe to our channel 1234 Media Bio, to keep information like this, in your brain.